All right, I decided to do another uh, uh, vlog, even though I haven't done one in a week or so since I decided that I was kind of not not just done doing topless stuff on topless topics, but like done doing anything under the topless topics moniker at all. Um, I guess I'll put this out there for now till I get the rest of my my things organized. But um, first of all, first of all, let check it out. I got my first stabby stab at long last. My dad has been vaccinated for over a month and then my husband got vaccinated like at the very beginning because the place where he works was uh, serving as an educational facility. So I've been eagerly counting the, <laughs> counting the weeks, the months, the days till I could get mine. Um, kids, you know, they're still too young to get theirs. So that still will be a concern, but at least, you know, those of us who actually leave the house except for, you know, parks, um, <laughs> we'll, uh, we'll be protected and I still have a wear mask and stuff. I, uh, I'm going to put it back in karate, um, since, you know, my dad especially is protected, um, and, you know, we can't keep him inside forever. At least I live in a state where there's still a mask mandate and everything like that, and, uh, the, his level of karate, they have the parents stay outside, so, um, you know, there is a risk, but I feel like it's not that high here. There's a dog pooping behind me. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, let's, let's look at something more pleasant. Um, <laughs> um, I guess at least there, there's not a dog, you know, doing the doing the duty. Um, there's kids over there playing uh, with the kite, which is kind of cute. Except that Link saw it, and now he's like, "Mommy, I want a kite. Can we get a kite?" Anyway, so uh, yeah, um, it was the I think it was the Pfizer. I don't know. They paused. Hi. They paused the Johnson & Johnson, which I'm glad for because, well, I already said why in previous vlogs, but basically Johnson & Johnson lied about their products causing ovarian cancer, so I don't really trust them. Um, <laughs> but yeah, we'll see how that goes. Um, but yeah, so I spent today, uh, before I had to go, you know, get my shot and stuff, um, either changing the names, if I could, for old accounts of mine to my new, not new, my... I don't, I don't have it, honey. I think we left it at the house. But there's no other kids playing there right now, so I think you're fine. It's okay, honey. We're outside, so you'll be fine on the outside. It's still funny to me when I see, like, little old people walking and they all have masks on. Oh, he wants to pet the dog. That's why. I don't think she heard you. Okay. All right, so anyway, um, yeah. so I spent today, no, don't climb on the table, please. No. Why are you trying to climb on the table? No, don't sit on the table. Please go play in the, you want to go home? Go play in the playground. Then lay on the grass. This, okay, Link, this has splinters, and there's spiders and stuff that crawl on it, okay? So anyway, I spent today, um, changing what I could and then making new counts for what I couldn't. Um, my new old uh, gaming channel, which was originally called Games Are For Fight, which is a reference for a stupid WoW meme back when the restrictions, like the, the character length and stuff for YouTube was a lot more restrictive and it was before the people making phrases out of their names, like, you know, like a lot of the currently popular people do. Um, or I don't even know if they're currently, <laughs> I don't know anyone that's still popular, but you know, I don't know. Um, a couple of years ago is when a lot of them started to get popular. Oh, he's just laying on the ground. <laughs> uh, how can you be so tired? You're only four. Um, <clears throat> uh, anyway, yeah, it used to be called Games Are For Fight, and then I sort of, I tried to rebrand as Sari Got Game, and they wouldn't let me change the URL um, from Games Are For Fight. Like, I could change the display name, but not the URL, so that was confusing. I used to have a website for it. I, I took it down when I decided to, you know, put all my gaming stuff and everything in under Papa's Topics. But, uh, now oh, there's some other kids there. Oh, there's Aiden. Um, but yeah, like, uh, so basically where I'm at is, um, I'm probably gonna just make everything on Papa's Topics, uh, private. Um, any, any closed stuff and then any unclosed stuff I'm gonna just take off completely 
because you know they're even private videos can get banned and then um, I'm still slowly putting the old videos up on library Odyssey whatever it is and then if a you know decent alternative platform comes along that I always say I understand the difference between nudity and sex, um, then I'll explore it, but um, yeah, that's that's that plan, and then I'm going to instead put my energies into his channel, Links Plays, and then my old gaming oh, cool. channel, and it's not going to just be gaming, it's also going to be, you know, drawing, digital illustration, like I keep meaning to, to start this 100 Pokemon 100 days thing where I look at the list of the bajillions of Pokemon out there and I pick one that I feel like drawing that day and I just do a couple sketches of it um and i want to live stream while i do it hi doing a vlog hey, you can sit you okay oh no it's fine i'm just letting you know um but it's kind of awkward if he's standing there behind me <laughs> that's my dad <laughs> bye um anyway so yeah i'm i'm Putting it all in private, um, uploading the old ones to library, and uh, I'm not gonna make any new, any new top of stuff for like a lot, a while, if ever. I just I got to the point when we're, you know, as I've said before, I'm really tired of dealing with the censorship, and two, I just don't really feel the need. I mean. <clears throat> I, I've never really been, man, I look super wrinkly right now. Um, I'm squinting a little because of the sun. I, um, and I'm old. <laughs> 35. Then I'm turning 36 this year, you know, in ever many months, November. Um, I don't feel that old. Anyway, um, I, uh, I just don't feel the need anymore because the people that genuinely support me, um, I feel like, you know, like me as a person, not just my reptiles. And so therefore, the, the only ones that are watching it specifically for the tats are the perverts and the haters. And, you know, they're not a good reason to keep doing it. I don't care about numbers. I don't care about views and everything like that if it's coming from people I don't value. So even though, you know, I'll have way, 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 way fewer subscribers and everything like that if I go back to focusing on video games, I still feel like it'll be a better use of my time, one, because I, hopefully, won't be dealing with the same bullshit non-stop censorship, and for another, you know, I get to focus on stuff I actually care about, like video games, like I keep saying, I, you know, I support nudism, obviously, naturism, whatever you want to call it, um, but I just don't feel the need to talk about it and, like, be naked all the time and stuff, like, I've never really cared about that, so I, uh, I'd much rather talk about video games and comics and movies and cosplay and drawing and stuff like that. So I think it'll be more, more, it'll be more fulfilling. It'll be better for my mental health. It'll be less of a time waste on administrative and censorship bullshit. And, um, it'll just be fun, you know, make video making fun again. Um, I finished my taxes yesterday. So that was, that was nice. Um, I, I know it's it, if if they hadn't extended it, it would have been late. Sort of started on my mom's, not really. Um, I spent like hours going through a bunch of her papers and trying to figure out which ones I need to do her taxes and setting them aside. But it's amazing that she kept so many papers and yet they're so badly disorganized and she kept like so many things that don't matter, but I don't know if they matter or not that somehow, even with all these papers, I'm not finding the stuff I need to do her taxes. And I do have to do her taxes because my dad, you know, is still alive. And even if he wasn't, if the money, you know, if the IRS was like, hey, she owes us this money, but she's dead. Well, we're going to take it from you. <laughs> I mean, suppose, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know exactly how it's supposed to work, but I know that, you know, when you're not uh, rich enough to hire the best accountant in the world, you're kind of at the mercy of what the IRS decides to do to you, so that's fun. Hi, monster. <laughs> Ow! Hit me. <laughs> you're such a ham. <laughs> you're such a ham. Okay, go play. He's, he's, a, he's a camera hog like his mom. <laughs> now he's comedically falling to the ground. So anyway, yeah, um, I, I, t I was able to change the Twitch name to Sari Got Game. Um, and I'm going to put a bunch of, you know, Facebook posts about it, not Facebook, uh, 
I mean, I, I'll use Facebook on the Sarah Got Game, and I freaking hate Facebook because that's what everyone else uses, so that's the only way I can reach new people. Um, and trust, trust me that I will still be saying like all the same stuff that I did before. I'll just, you know, be not doing it topless. Uh, <laughs> um, so you know, if you if you like to tune in for my uh, uh, political rants and then and, you know break the patriarchy, eat the rich, uh, castigate the purrs <laughs> uh, type com commentary, that's definitely going to still be a part of it. You know, I've never put on a persona in any like for the longest you know for all the years I've been making videos, I've never been a character. Um, I mean, I've had like isolated parody skits and stuff like that but other than that you know all these videos like this are just me um <laughs> yeah slowly link don't be too excited okay <laughs> yeah ours pulls really hard too oh <laughs> Oh, I know. He's. I have to warn him because he's so intense that. Yeah, that's good, Link. I'm very happy that you asked. That's Aiden. Anyway, so that's that. Um, go follow Sarah Got Game on Twitter and Facebook and Instagram and everything like that if you want to know when the new gaming stuff is out. Um, I will continue my Saturday live streams. I'll just do them as twitch.tv slash Sarah Got Game. Um, C E R I G O T. Gay, uh, G A M E. Although it's funny I mentioned gay because putting in the bio or whatever, I, I wrote gamer girl, but I did it gay mer girl, <laughs> which you know, gamer girl as a term is, has gone through an evolution of like, you know, oh it's so gross and fake and whatever. I'm like I don't care. I'm a girl and I love games, so it's a it's an accurate <laughs> accurate moniker. Um, but yeah, I put gay mer girl because I am you know 95 percent lesbian anyway. Um, yeah. What? You didn't know that? <laughs> you must not watch my videos very much or you watch them on mute. Um, yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna go now. Like I said, look up Sari Got Game, C-E-R-I-G-O-T-G-A-M-E -E, if you want to follow those and uh, I'll, uh, I'll keep you apprised of, of any other changes.